Hey everybody. Today I'm going to be teaching Deck the Halls, seasonal favorite. Sorry I haven't posted in a while. I'm happy to be back. I'm going to try to do a bunch of Christmas holiday tutorials coming up. So uh, I'll play through it as always and then I'll break it down note by note. Um, and you'll be able to uh, hopefully get a good idea of what it sounds like. And if you want to learn it, stick around. We'll uh, do it note by note after that. All right? That's it. A little rough. Sorry, I'm kind of offset here because of the stand that I have, but um, that's the idea of it. Um, you can play it more formally, more casually, depending on your style. Um, if you do... It's like kind of staccato, um, kind of bouncy. Um, that's more like casual fun, but if you wanted to play it in more of a... You know, you can play it more like uh, drawn out as long as you know the notes, which I will teach you. Um, so, in the right hand, uh, let's start out with the left hand actually, bass line. So, that whole part is over just an F uh, fifth. So, it's F, one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, five, excuse me, and it's C, so it's just a C, um, a triad without the middle, so it's a fifth. So, it's F and C. You're going to play that with your pinky and thumb. Okay. And then we're going to play that over. And we're going to hit the G in the right hand, which I'll get to. We're going to jump to a C, so a C and a G. If you can't see that, it's a C and a G right there. C, G, all right. And then back to F. Okay. So F and C again. So practice that, F and C. Okay, and then the next part where it goes... Like this is B flat and F, another fifth, C and G again, and then back up to F and C. So it's really simple in that hand, and then there's minor variations throughout, that's the main idea. So, try to play along with me on this one in the left hand, right? And it gets a little quick there at the end, so let me play real slow. That's it. If you want the simplified version of that, uh, just play F. And then just hold F and C. Honestly, you don't even have to go to C. It just uh, it's more simple and simplified that way. It's more exciting. If you add those kind of different uh, fifths, okay? Um, and so in the left hand you've got that, and then the next part is down we now. So all that is is the C and G again, C and G up to F and C. So and then this is the only variation, which is uh, A and E, which is this is still a fifth but um, a minor fifth. Then to D and A. DNA. And then I just do a walk down on a C, G, C. But you really only have to do hold a C on that if you want. I guess the uh, fifth if you wanted. Okay? But I do C, G, C. And then back to F for the final thing. Excuse me. Right there, you're hitting a B flat and an F. Okay, in the left hand, and then up to C and G. Excuse me, it's uh, back to F and C that time. So it's B and F, and then F and C, and then then it's the B flat and F, C and G, F and C thing again. Sorry, I jumped ahead a little bit there. 
So don't worry if you don't have those all down now. It's hard to play those and figure out where you are with the right hand without it, I mean. So uh, what we're going to do now is just go through this. So, so that is just your hands in a fifth position on the your thumb on F and uh, pinky on C there. And then I kind of do a, I roll up to it, so I just, just quick play that. So up from F to C. So C, B flat, A, G, F, G, A, F. <laughs> it's kind of hard to say them without being in tone with them or the, the note. But uh, and you, if you know the melody, you will um, pick it up pretty quick. Um, it's just C, B flat, A, G, F, G, A, F. Then the next part is... So it's um, fa la la la. It's the uh, G A B flat. Excuse me. G A B flat G A G F E F. That's the only tricky part there, where it's crossing your thumb to your second finger on E and then back to F. So from the beginning, if you want to play that part with me, um, I'll play it really slow. frustrated when I say I'm playing it slow and then I don't, so I'm going to play it even slower. Okay? And then you just play through that twice, that whole thing, and then you go to the Don we now. And that is G, A, B flat, G. Okay, and then it's A, B flat, C, G. Okay, so. Mm, mm, mm. It always returns the G there. Okay, and then the next part is up three, so it's just A, B, natural, not flat, so. To C. Sorry, it's over uh, D there. Okay, and then that's just up, so. Uh, A, B, C. D, E, F, and then just one down to E, D, C. Okay, and that goes with the C, G, C. Or just the C chord or fifth if you want in the left hand. And then back to F. Same thing as the beginning, deck the halls. And then this time it's different, you slide your hand up a little bit, excuse me, to D. D to C for one. Excuse me. And then it just walks down. Excuse me. One, two, three, four. D, 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 C, B flat, A, G, F. Okay? And just walks down. When you put it together, it sounds like this, and I'll try to play it pretty slow and see if you can join in after a while. Of course, it'll take a minute to practice, but just go back and review the different parts and try to put them together like this so that they fit in sync here. I'll play a couple styles so that you can get an idea of the different ways that you can play this. Sorry if I mess up. I haven't really been practicing in different styles, but I just said it, so I'm going to have to do it. <laughs> here we go. Since I was playing in different styles, that would have been hard to play along with, but I wanted to show you the variety you can do. Um, and so I'll play it normally as I kind of taught it now with just the fifths, pretty simple, okay? Here we go.
I just hit an F because it ends on that. Okay, so if there are any questions, post them in the comments. Um, request any Christmas songs you want to learn or holiday songs, um, seasonal ones, uh, and I'd be happy to teach them. I'm also going to teach some other ones today and different things, so uh, keep an eye out for those and subscribe if you haven't. Let me know if there's any questions. Thanks for watching.